So now what I want to do is you take your fan. Shit's dirty. <laughs> take your fan, lay it down. You're going to take your motherboard, flip it over, line up the holes to where those clamps were, and we're going to bolt it down. Line that bitch up. There we go. We line that bitch up. You want to make sure it's on the heat sinks. And now we're going to install our cardboard and clamps. I showed you guys the cardboard earlier. That's so that you don't ground out the clamps on the motherboard. I lost my other cardboard clamps, so I'm going to cut a new set. Right here, we'll cut these to size. Then we'll cut the other one the same way. All right, get rid of those. All right, <clears throat> now you're going to lay your cardboard right down in the middle between the holes, just like that. Now you're going to take your clamps and toss them on. And remember, it's like 100 fucking degrees here where I am. I only got AC in my room, not in the living room. So you want to tighten these down, but not too much. You don't want to damage anything. firm just to snug up so you feel a little resistance. Now it's very important you protect all these transistors. I have broken transistors before in Rowan PlayStation. <clears throat> now we'll snug those up. All right, that feels good. Now, we're gonna flip this bitch over and we're gonna have to plug your fan in. So, plug that in. Now, we got that all set. Move your screws back up. Now it's time to insert the E3 flasher itself. Now this is money right here. Alright, so we got our power cable in. We're letting that dry. Now we got to insert our suit clip. Same thing with the clip. You're going to want to make sure this is clean also. All those little contacts, you got a lot of little contacts in there. Make sure that's all nice and clean. I keep my shit clean, so it's pretty good. Blow on it. Now, like I told you, you want your clip. Let's pull this off. You're going to want your ribbon cable to go away from that hole that's on the bottom left of your Nord chip. So, what I do is, you're going to want to put this on and wait for it just to drop on. You'll feel it. 
you want to make sure it's on just right because if you put it on crooked, you'll fuck it up. Brand new ones will make a snap sound. Mine doesn't make a snap sound anymore because I used it too many times. It'll only snap the first time. So that's on. Now you're going to want to tape it. <clears throat> what I use is a penny with double sided tape. And I'll show you why I use double sided tape. Okay, we got that on. Don't worry about the tape hitting the transistors and stuff. It ain't gonna do shit. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is take a piece of cardboard, I mean styrofoam, put that bitch right on the top. Double sided tape's gonna hold that on. Make sure it's nice and even. There we go. Now this big piece of styrofoam goes on the bottom. That protects your transistors. Now we can apply the C clamp. See on my C clamp, I got a little styrofoam down there. That's to protect it. And so it doesn't short out. Let me open this bitch up. Alright. So, there's only one of me. So, I'm going to make sure I do this correctly. Fucking hot as fuck right now in here. I would have done it in the bedroom, but I got that much room in there. Now, the reason why we apply the C clamp to put nice pressure on that NOR chip, on that E3 flasher. So you just want to, don't not too tight, you want to go just enough to where there's a little resistance. Okay, kind of stop there, go a cunt hair more. That should be good. Now let me go grab my other tool. So I'm going to need something to prop up the other side of that. Let me get a couple games. This is what I like to use. <clears throat> Modern Warfare 2, Advanced Warfare, GTA 5. Those motherfuckers. Now, let's bring this bitch up. Put that just like so. Now we need to install a power supply. This motherfucker right here is dirty. Let me clean that real quick. Alright. So now, let's get our E3 ribbon cable out of the way. Bring this to the front, like so. Now, you gotta put this motherfucker on. You got ah, there are the prongs. You gotta line this bitch up just right. All right. Now plug your power supply in. A lot of these connections are a little bit different than what I'm used to, but it's all good. 
same deal. Where the fuck? Oh yeah, we're going to pull our power supply out. I forgot about that. Right out of the case. There we go. This is our power supply. Your power cord goes into. Now, this is going to go right on here. There we go. That one on nice. All right, we got that in. We got that in. All right. So now this is a one shot deal. Now you want to hook up your E3 flasher. Let's move this shit to the back just a little. Now, with the Q-tip we had in alcohol, you want to clean your E3 flasher. Make that sure that shit's nice. Same thing with the ribbon cable. Make sure that shit's nice. There's going to be a little outline for your cable on your E3 flasher. Just line it up. Snaps right in. There we go. Now a lot of people like to hook this up to your hard drive and all that bullshit. There's no need for that. Absolutely no need. So like I showed you before, you got your sand disk. Little chip. Thank you.